And I'm joined now with the woman of the of the story, Peyton Strickland, and her mom and dad, Melissa and Lane. Hi, guys. Hello. Thank you all for being here this afternoon. I know last year we didn't get to see y'all in person. It was pre-recorded, and then Radiothon was kind of goofy, too. So it's good to see y'all's sweet faces. And let me tell you, you are not the same girl that we met a year and a half ago, two years ago. You are stunning. Look Thank at you. you. Tell me how you've been doing. I'm good. We've just been hanging out with family and swimming. Swimming is that where you're getting all that natural blonde, <laughs> sun kissed no. hair? No. So you were, tell me where you go to school. Lee Middle School. Lee Middle School. And what did what grade did you just complete? Seven. So big eighth grader running the school next year. <laughs> When you think back to your story, does it seem like it was a long time ago or like something that just happened yesterday? I feel, yeah, I feel like it was yesterday. And tell me how you're doing with, with everything, your progress and how your leg is today. Well, I'm about to start water aerobics. As a part of your it. therapy? Yes. And what's that going to do? It's going to help me be more mobile. Nice. You also mentioned something, Peyton, about um, the end of the year you've got another surgery scheduled. What's that for? It's to make it smaller, my scars smaller. Your scars, so that you can they wear. Better. Yeah, up some. That's exciting. That's, mm -hmm. it's, there's progress. Every time I talk to you, there's more progress, and it's just, mm -hmm. do, you, do you find that that's healing for you, yeah. for your spirit, too, from everything that you've been through, and y'all as family to see her? Yes, yeah, very much so. So I want to talk to y'all for just a minute. Can I talk to your parents for just a second? Mm -hmm. What a journey she has been on, and, and y'all too. Um, Children's Miracle Network played a significant role when she first hit Shannon uh, that day at the ER. Tell us about what that meant to y'all to know that Children's Miracle Network had part to do with her, yeah, her just, recovery. Just everybody was so helpful, and uh, the training that they had and the way that everybody treated us at the ER it was amazing. And um, Dr. Jastro and his team were just phenomenal, and help save her life and, and even help her just to walk again. And they did save her life. Yeah, that absolutely. was so tragic. Yep. Absolutely. <laughs> Melissa, what, look, when you look at your beautiful daughter now, what do you look at and just think? Uh, just a miracle. <laughs> absolutely. A beautiful miracle. So tell me about your summer, Peyton. What do you have planned this summer? We're going to go to the beach in Corpus Christi. And is that going to be coming up pretty quick? or? It's in August. In August, okay. Wonderful. Well, we love that you're a part of our CMN family, and you get to come back every time. There's no, I don't care if you're graduating, you're still going to be a part of our team. But thank you all for being here and sharing your evening with us. We love you so much. Okay, Jay and Snora, back to you guys.